Welcome back to another edition of Trial by Fire. Michelle's joining me once again. I know. To taste our taste buds. To or taste our tickle taste buds. Tickle our tickles. No, so we're gonna, so we're gonna tickle our taste buds instead. That sounds better. Because <laughs> well, technically, don't you always taste your taste buds, sir? Or did they yeah, just they just don't taste too good. Yeah. Mm, okay. We got residuals. Kind of an eggnog residual. Yeah, we had ice cream earlier from a local place that yes. unfortunately is closing like for the season, not properly, thankfully. Yeah. And they had some interesting they had I got an eggnog shake. You did. And you got a pumpkin spice latte. I did. Shake. Because I'm a white girl. <laughs> yeah. Typical white girl. I had uh, pumpkin spice. I'm okay with that. But it's that time of season. That time of season. That time of year is <laughs> <laughs> Wow, you can really tell that I just fumble words all the time. Anyways, so we're here with the purple mm. tongue hot sauces, and that one didn't ten time me. Yeah. I almost got messed up again. <laughs> but we have five sauces left of theirs. I know. That we, we have not tried, or I have not tried. These are the last five. Usually, I try them on videos if I'm by myself, and then she ends up trying them later. So she has tried them, just not necessarily yeah. on camera. But so. Even though we got five and not six, I gotta die. So we're gonna we're gonna die and find out. Hopefully they're not that bad. I don't even know what they are. I haven't even read them. I just know they're. I can see we, them from the back. We got an orangey one, a black one, which is kind of thin. Uh, another thin blackish one, a greenish, Grayish? greenish gray, and then a more brown one. Yeah. So which doesn't sound appetizing when you just. And I can't those. read them from here. No. And I don't have my glasses. So. Yeah. Which way, which way are we going to go from? One or one? I don't know. Let me decide on that. If you can actually just go off camera and grab my glasses out of the case there. Bye. <laughs> then I can actually see today. Uh, glasses. Sure. Sort of a necessity. Yeah. It's a bare necessity. They're not bear shaped. Let's make sure they're the right ones. Can you see? Yeah, I'm just making sure they're the right ones and not the, the bad set. <laughs> for his bad eyes. Well, I one one set for one eye, one set for another. These are my good eyes, child. <laughs> Check my good eyes. <laughs> so, since the viewers are going to be watching, oh. and, and you're going to be on the... I'm on the, the right side? Right side of the screen. I'm always on the right side. And we read left to right, so we will go one, two, three, four, five. Okay. So that way it's easier for them. I'm number five. I'm number one. Damn it. <laughs> At least we don't have number two. <laughs> <laughs> so, here we go. Never mind, Never. it's number two. We're going to do number two. We have to do a number two, so we'll be right back. <laughs> Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the toilet. <laughs> so this one here, if you can see it, because I can't see it. Yay! Yay! Should have a little confetti. <laughs> Do a covert wave. Yes. So this one, without looking at the sauce here, no idea. <laughs> uh, take a bite, feel the bite. It has, okay, so I'm not going to read the ingredients because I want you to see what it is. This is a two out of five. Two out of five. So it's not going to be a spicy one. It's not, it's a, spi not a spicy meatball. Yeah, I should going to say that. It's not a spicy meatball. <laughs> We're both thinking the same thing. Yeah, kind of happens when you Watch else. out with that knife. It's not a knife, it's a kniffle. It's not quite Halloween. You don't need to have blood spurting out. Now, I've already cut myself on a knife recently, so. That was at work. You can't trust that men in knives. You can trust men in, in uh, kilts. You can. Nothing wrong with a guy in a kilt. Oh. Or, or men in tights, too. That sounds very liquidy. <laughs> it is. But you can always trust a man in tights, too. Because of manly men. Men, <laughs> we're men in tights. God, that's a good song. Good movie. Okay, so I will put up here so you guys can see what which it is without me saying anything, so that way I can get Michelle to try and guess Spoon. without looking. Have a smell. 
Watch it stick to my finger. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what, what you got on your finger. It's it wasn't, it's it wasn't sticking to me. It was just it's still not sticking to me. <laughs> it likes me. So it's on your finger. To me, it smells like a sweet teriyaki. Okay, yeah, I can see that. Like it has a very sweet teriyaki taste. So it is a very thin-ish thin, sauce. Thin-ish. How are you? <laughs> it's you. <laughs> oh wow! I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna have a lot. Apparently, it's gonna be really good. Cheers. It's a little bit of heat, not like it's, but it's present. It's not like it's. It does have that Asian. I'm not sure like if I'm soy picking sauce. up on what it actually. Is it a ghost pepper? No. No, it's got a bit of a a bite similar to a ghost. Yeah, unfortunately, the card that came with it just says what it pairs well with. It doesn't really say the ingredients on it, so I'll have to we bring we check those to tell you. It's not bad though. Do you want to try it a little bit more, see if you can guess? Yeah, I'll put a little bit more. Stick to the bottle again. <laughs> see, I'm, I'm touching the bottle, right where you were. He likes me. Right. I do like that. Have a little bit more of that. Because it is actually pretty decent. <laughs> I like that one. Like I said, it's very Asian. It's like a teriyaki soy sauce. Like, I would definitely have that with, like, <clears throat> egg rolls or chicken balls. Well, since you guys know what it is... And how, you think she's guessing pretty well? Probably not. Let me know in the comments. Obviously, it's be late by the time that she knows what it is. But did yeah. you guess before or kind of think she's on the nose? So the ingredients on this one is pineapple, oh. habanero, uh, soy sauce. Okay. Definitely taste of the soy sauce. Um, apple cider vinegar. Garlic, yep. olive oil, green onion, yellow onion, water, and Himalayan pink sea salt, black pepper. Okay. So, I mean, I was right about the soy sauce and the uh, teriyaki, but I did not, I didn't taste the pineapple. Yeah, it's pineapple soy. But it's good. Yeah. Red habanero. Did you taste the pineapple? I got a little bit of, I think maybe knowing that it was in there okay, is why I maybe tasted it. But it's actually, it's a decent it's sauce. It's a nice one. It's, yeah, you can literally, what does it have on here for, uh, it's got, um, pairs well with stir fry dumplings, chicken yeah. wings, jerk Perfect. chicken, pork, uh, po ramen noodles. I could see it in um, ramen. Salmon, clams, fried tofu, fried rice, coconut shrimp. So basically, yeah. any Asian dish it would go really yeah. well with. That would because be of the soy. really good with chicken bowls. Yeah, or just not like if you got chicken fried rice, just add oh, a little yeah. bit more of this on to give it a little bit of kick. And a that. nice ramen bowl with that on top of the noodles. Oh yeah, very good. That's like one of my favorites from them so far. I think. Yeah, they, Purple Tongue has always done good sauces. Yeah, um, there were some in the beginning when I first tried it that I wasn't a fan of, but that's just personally. Yeah. Is I'm not a fan of the Verde type sauces or certain flavorings. Like this one has two different types of onion in it, but I would still use it because they're far enough down. Yeah. And it's not, I'm but not feeling good. anything off of it, but it's, yeah, it's a really good sauce. Considering it only has habanero, it has a nice bite of heat too. Yeah. It's, like I, I would have sworn there was a little bit of ghost in there because it does have a lingering. Well, the thing is the pineapple would have enhanced the heat. Oh uh, yeah. The acidic pineapple. Yeah. It's good. Because it's pineapple and then red habanero. So you got the heat there. I would say heat wise, probably maybe a one and a half or a two. Yeah, I'd say two for me. A little um, bit more hot, I think, for me than you. Yeah, it was just, it's an, the initial kick of heat is there and then it's gone. But it's for, just letting you know that it's there. Taste wise. Taste wise, I'd probably put this at about a seven. Yeah, I'd, I'd say eight and a half. It's, it was really good. It's, like, I would, yeah. I would get that. They've done a great job with this, and I'm delicious. hoping, because I'm not sure when this one's going to air versus Ooh. when that thing's going to happen, but we're either at Goat Fest right we now. We could be there right now. I hope we're having a good time. 
I hope so. Because if, be, if we're not having a good time... Time traveling us, come back and let us know if we had a good yeah, time. Cause it's, yeah, I, hope, I really hope we're having a good time. Because it just seems like... It, it's. And be, hopefully we're not arrested. I don't know why we would be, but you never know. What are you planning on doing there? I never know. There's no goats there. You do realize that, right? <laughs> so there's no sacrificing any goats. No, I wouldn't sacrifice. I pet all the goats. I like the goats. The goat whisperer? Bah. Yeah. Be the original goat whisperer? Sure, why not? Be the goat? I'd be the goat. I'd be the best. <laughs> Greatest of all time goat whisperer. Anyway. anyway. So, yeah, if you happen to be going to Goat Fest or went to Goat Fest and saw us there, if this has happened before or after... Hopefully yeah. you guys had a good time too. So yeah, but I know they're going to be there. Hopefully, maybe they have a new uh, sample pack I can pick up because mm -hmm. I've been loving doing this with the sample packs. Yeah, sample okay. packs are awesome. Yeah, and it's a great way to, to try multiple flavors of sauces from multiple companies. Yeah. Um, if you're not sure on them, so exactly what they're for, sample packs. So. But that one was a damn yeah. good one. So once again, the Purple Ton Hot Sauce Company's Pineapple Soy. Red habanero sauce, so a two Excellent. out of three on heat up for them. I gave it about a one and a half. You said two. I said around a two. And seven for flavor, and you said eight, 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 eight and a half. half. Yeah. It was good. But yeah, like I said, I think that's my favorite of them so far. But we've got four other ones. That yeah. So stay know. tuned for four more videos. Ooh. <laughs> and you can try them with it. Well, you can experience us trying them for you, and then go out and buy one, and then try it. And or then what you stop. could do is. Pause this video, go to the website, order their sample pack, watch the next videos once it comes in with us, and you could try it at the same time. It could be a whole new experience of trying the sauce while your YouTube channel that you're viewing That's is trying true. it as well. It does sound awfully complicated, but it's doable. It's almost like a Patreon thing when you watch live with people. Sure. It's, it's a bonus to that. It's just It's costing you time and, yeah. But anyways. <laughs> On that note. That would be an interesting thing to do. It would be. Is, yeah, you guys get the sauce. I get the sauce. We try them together. Yep. Don't know how we technically do that. Unless it's a live one, but. Still very good. Yeah. Future ideas. But So, yeah. Purple Ton, uh, pineapple soy, very good. Very good. And we'll definitely have that again. So, until next time, enjoy the heat, stay spicy. We'll see you later to dry, to try to try mm -hmm. more sauces. My ton is getting tied by the purple ton. Oh, there you go. Is it purple? Not quite. No. Not quite. <laughs> we'll see you next time. <laughs> Why? <laughs> yeah, they have to buy it. They, yes. they don't have it yet. If they won't try it otherwise. Let yeah. that have it in their cupboard. You don't know. They could have it. They could, be. They could have it in the closet. Yeah.